this is the energy vibration um, um, <laughs> reading for the first quarter that is the month of January to until March for the Virgos this is the energy vibration for the Virgos for the first quarter of the year 2018 and this is wonderful because the energy vibration for you Virgos is um, very very good um, because for you Virgos you have also the wheel of fortune as the Taurus is so obviously this year um, the energy vibration of the earth people are going to be very lucky and I'm seeing this happening for a lot of hurt signs okay so um, for you Virgos it's going to be a lucky year it's going to be the wheel of fortune in the first quarter but um, this is going to happen really for the people who have been just um, vibrated on a positive energies because not all you Virgos are um, very honest and very um, positive because you Virgos are always trying to get back at people and that is the worst thing you can do because you create karma and when it happens to you you are not really happened uh, um, um, liking this so um, I'm asking all you Virgos out there please be aware of what you do to other people because what I'm seeing here it is the energy of justice in January in February is the energy of the tower and in March you are having the energy vibration of the magician the magician in this way is not coming up to help you the magician is helping other people so be aware of whatever is happening for the people who have been vibrating on a very high energy vibration who have been honest to themselves and others around them then it's going to be a positive month in the month of March so let's go forward and look at your energy vibration reading and I haven't say thank you I'm just kind of going through because we're going to do the readings after this and of the month of January so this is the month of January and the month of January is bringing in the energy of justice whatever the situation is whatever injustice and um, this honesty that has um, happened and what you have done justice is going to come in so be aware of this because this is a karmatic situation so for you um, Virgos that has been vibrating not with an eye energy vibration and have uh, done something justice is going to come in and it's going to affect you in the month of January so be aware of this in the month of February there is going to be an eel in the tower blow up I love this card I think no one really understand what it means by the energy of the tower the tower needs to break down that which is no longer serving you there is an ending coming to something that is no longer serving you there's an healing that is coming in for some for most of the time the tower for some people is that you need is releasing you from something that no longer serve you and for some people the tower is that it is removing things and people places out of your life that no longer serve you this is the energy of the tower so um, this is going to happen in February February is a positive month so you can see the energy of the tower as being positive because what it's doing for you in the month of February is releasing you from situation people and things that no longer serve you as you move forward you have the energy of the magician this is positive because this is yellow this is um, working with finding yourself who you are so a situation is going to end abruptly and then you are going to be finding yourself and finding your true inner self of who you are and this is the the part that you are going to go on and this is going to be extremely extremely positive okay whatever the situation is whatever that is happening this is going to be extremely positive so let's look at what is going on for you and understand what is transferring and what is uh, attracting and what is happening for you okay so let's look um, for the Virgos and calling up in the angels and guides of the Virgos to come in and show us what is going to be the connection between justice and the tower justice and the tower what is the connection the energy between justice and the tower you have 
two four six a ten of swords ten of swords justice and the tower tens of swords a lot of people eating but biting stabbing lying and that sort of a thing it's coming to an end Whatever the, the lies and the things that were told and the backbiting and the, this is a karmatic situation and justice came in and the, the lies and things that were told the tower is coming down. So whatever that has transpired, this is the Ten of Swords, uh, whatever um, people were doing and that was not right and injustice and whatever the situation that was happening the justice came in and hand the whole situation and all the, uh, the 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 dishonesty and whoever that was lying and that sort of a thing is coming out so expected between the month of January and February for some people it's going to happen in January some people it's going to happen in February but there is going to be a cleansing of uh, people who were not speaking the truth and that sort of a thing it's finally going to come out and the truth is going to come out let's see what is happening between the tower and the magician for the virgos in the first quarter tarot and the tower and the magician for the virgos in the first quarter you have the energy of the princess of sword princess of sword okay let's let's uh, let's understand this let's understand this the princess of sword so wow This princess of swords I'm very quiet because I'm thinking because there is a situation because this princess of swords there's so many things that has been happening and you know what what I'm seeing here happening is a wheel of fortune because whoever whatever that has transpired this princess of swords and you know let's see what is the end energy to this because um, the princess of swords uh, um, you know it is uh, let's see what is happening to this princess of swords king of Pentacles okay in a strength okay you guys what is happening with this princess of swords she has been a lion and um this this princess of swords have been lying she hasn't been honest um for some of you who are having a relationship with the princess of sword this woman has been lying and has been honest and the energy of justice is coming up for her so um you virgos are going to have a situation with the energy of the princess of swords this princess of swords was doing something and what i've realized about these um princess of swords it could be an aquarius it could be a gemini or it could be a libra and whatever the situation is of was this princess of swords was not speaking the truth and the lies um, is the energy of justice coming in with the tower she wasn't speaking the truth and this magician is not really helping her because what is happening here is that the energy of the magician is the energy of <clears throat> the Gemini this is a Gemini man and uh, and the energy of a Gemini woman so the men and female um, Gemini's uh, who are connected to you Virgos there is so much things that has been happening there's so much secrets and things they were working together they were all working together and here is this king of Pentacles because the tower is on top of the print with the king of Pentacles whatever this king of Pentacles was doing and saying because 
if you look at this the king of pentacles it is the energy vibration because here he is this is the outcomes for you guys so what this is saying is that whatever lies that has been told during the Gemini people that is the energy of uh, um, the Gemini man and woman or it doesn't have to be the man is going to be a Gemini but the woman can be an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libran whoever these people are for you um virgos because you are the king of pentacles for you virgos what is going to happen is that there is going to be finally an end to all these lies and the situation with this libran or gemini or aquarius woman the energy of justice came in and it is you know bursting out all of these situation that is happening because there is a lot of situation that is happening because um some of you um virgos have to deal with this gemini woman and she wasn't being very honest because the the energy of the ten of swords is always that people are lying and not being honest and justice and the tower came in to reveal the lie and dishonest that this um, princess or princess of swords this is someone between the ages of 25 and 45 and the magician is an older energy the magician so there's a lot of lies that have been told and trust me um, you Gemini's you, you Virgos I know what that is like because I you know it's a secret of things happening and people not being honest and this person is trying to get a piece of the pie and that person is trying to get a piece of the pie and this person and finally justice came out and thing no no more they it's bringing an end towards the situation so you Virgos are going to be um coming out of this um, quarter in a very good thing because whatever is happening in the the whatever is happening for you Virgos in you know the positive thing of what is happening is that a release um, the secrets are being revealed because it's a karmatic situation that is happening for you Gemini's in the first quarter and whatever this what was the lies because you know and the, the, the whoever is this um, um, princess of swords she has been telling some lies and that sort of a thing and you Virgos and I'm, I'm seeing this play out for you Virgos because it's as if um, there is a Virgo out there there are Virgos out there who has um, who has a mother or a sister or an, an, a, a mother a sister or someone but the mother has been making up stories and saying things that is not true and whatever is happening is that this is going to break it down so it could be your mom it could be your sister it could be your girlfriend it could be um for the women it could be the friends the the, the mom the you know whoever it is but this king of pentacles you virgos are going to realize what is happening you, you you have realized what is happening that your mom or you know whoever it is is making so much um a situation that is happening and it is, it's going to come out the truth is going to come out there's going to be a revealing and the truth is going to come out so okay let's go on and see what else you have why do i want the relationship i want that is a good question think about what you want in relationships and why you want it look for those around you who have the experience and good relationship and feel appreciated for them make a list of the positive aspect of those good feelings relationship you want to have time to spend with in fact one of the first and finest ways to make your way to a wonderful relationship is to find any subject that a coincides with the feelings of good even if it has nothing to do with a relationship and focus on that so uh, this is this this is so positive this is so good uh, for you Virgos uh, 
think about why do you want the relationship you want this is really really something to think about because trust me some of you are going to be finding out that your mother or your girlfriend or um um, your mom or your girlfriend because it has to do with someone who is a Virgo or um, um, Aquarius a Libra or a um, Aquarius a Libra or a Gemini person there was so much lies and stuff because the ten of swords is just lies and people um, stabbing you in the back and that sort of a thing and you're going to find out about that and this there is going to be an explosion in the month of uh, um, March and in, in the month month of February and the month of March you're just going to decide to move away from that let's see what you receive the throat chakra the throat chakra so for you Virgos it is heal your throat chakra call upon Archangel Michael to heal your throat chakra the frequency of the throat chakra the blue flowers of life supports our self experience and our sense of peace and balance so the energy of the the, the, the throat chakras okay be aware of this use the energy of the throat chakras and what I want to say to you Gemini's before we move forward is that um, I understand what you're going through because I'm realizing that a lot of hurt people, earth sign people, are working with the air sign people, and um, this could be your mom, your sister, or um, you're going to find out that someone very close to you hasn't been honest to you. And I'm finding this out also. I've had relationships with two um, Libra person who I think no never next time I see a Libra I'm going to run as far as I can <laughs> so um, whatever the situation is that is happening um, speak the truth and you will survive this okay I'm, I'm, I'm sorry but yeah, at the end of the day you're going to win this and it's for you men it's going to affect some of you men because you came out anyway um but run run whenever i see that uh, next time namaste bye